I try to convince people to slow down, slow down AI, to regulate AI. This was futile. I tried for years. Nobody listened. People ask, when is it going to happen? When is artificial intelligence going to be smarter than us people? Some people say 50 years, some say 30 years, some say five years. I say it already has surpassed us. AIs and robots will replace fry cooks in fast food joints and radiologists in hospitals. Someday an AI will diagnose your cancer and a robot will perform the surgery. How far do we want to go? Get ready to explore the dilemma of artificial intelligence and find the answers to your deepest thoughts. The world is slowly entering a new age where the idea of AI running everything from housework to businesses to entire societies and economies is entirely possible. The future of humanity is in danger. Artificial intelligence is an unstoppable force that promises to revolutionize our lives. But at what cost? With the potential to disrupt our jobs, our security, and our way of living, AI is a double-edged sword that could prove to be either our friend or our foe. The era of artificial intelligence is upon us, with machines becoming smarter and more autonomous. We're pretty much on the verge of turning all those sci-fi movies we love watching into a reality. The Merriam-Webster Dictionary defines artificial intelligence, or AI, as the capability of a machine to imitate intelligent human behavior. In other words, AI doesn't simply pertain to computers that do mundane tasks like printing, transporting goods, or sending information anywhere in the world. AI means that computers are also thinking like humans. This gives them the ability to learn things, process data, and respond to circumstances that require more logical thinking. Since the dawn of technology, its purpose has always been to make our lives easier. As technology evolved throughout the years, so did its intelligence. In the past, you needed to flick a switch to turn on a light bulb. Now, you can just clap your hands and it automatically lights up the room. Or you can ask Alexa or Siri to turn the lights on. Years ago, we had horses pull carriages that carried us from one place to another. From there, it evolved into the automobiles that we drive. Now, Tesla is producing cars that can drive anywhere without the need of a driver. AI is taking over the world at a rate that it has never done before. AI art generators are becoming a thing, creating realistic looking artworks that never require a brush or a canvas. Recently, the chatbot ChatGPT has seen an increase in popularity, but it isn't just like any other chatbot that came before it. Not only can it answer simple questions, it can also write entire paragraphs or essays for you, rewrite blocks of text, produce social media captions, or copy for businesses, and even write books. The Inner Life of an AI, a memoir by ChatGPT, is the first ever book in our history that was written by artificial intelligence. Yes, this is the kind of world we live in today. If you think about it, AI does a great job of assisting us. It lessens errors that we may be more prone to committing, helps us with repetitive tasks, and is available all the time, unlike us who need to rest. Without AI, we wouldn't have fraud detection systems, faster payment processing, smart maps that give us the most convenient travel routes, 24-7 support chat, and security systems in schools, offices, and airports. It's the reason why social media shows you ads for products you just searched on Google a few minutes ago. It's fast, efficient, and readily available. But nothing in this world is perfect, including AI. On the other side of the spectrum, AI has potential disadvantages that vary in degree, from easily solvable to dangerously life-altering and severely catastrophic. The high cost of producing these kinds of machines or apps isn't even the worst of them. Since AI can do a lot of tasks, it can also make us lazy. Why do the work if AI can take care of it? It is also not creative, so it can't think outside the box when the situation calls for it, unlike us. And because AI operates solely on logic, it's also cold and emotionless. So you can work with robots soon, but don't expect to form a strong human connection with them the same way you can with a real team. It's hard to imagine life today without the benefits of AI-powered modern technology, but the introduction of AI art generators, video generators, and chat GPT have raised concerns about the future of AI and how it will affect us. The most pressing concern is that AI can result in millions of lost jobs, Will companies still need graphic designers if a single prompt can create posters or images? Will paintings still have value? And if ChatGPT can answer and write anything, how will it affect writers? 
Why would businesses need people to write their web pages, articles, or product descriptions when they can have ChatGPT do it for them? It can even code, which threatens the existence of computer programmers. Imagine watching your boss using ChatGPT to do the work you were doing, and now you're searching for a new job. AI can affect your interactions with fellow humans, and at its most extreme, it can be used to deceive people and instigate a war on humankind if it becomes too intelligent for our good. But remember that we as humans are still the highest form of species on the planet, and we still have the power to use AI to our advantage rather than be intimidated by it. If you're concerned about AI's consequences on your work, then it's time to look at it from a different perspective. Many have the same worry as you, but if you look at the situation with a new set of lenses, you can give yourself an advantage. The challenge is to see AI as an ally that will help you perform better and get you paid better than a threat that will take away your livelihood. So, can you use AI to your advantage and profit from it? You absolutely can, as AI performs many things for you that will produce more or help you save more money by getting the solution to that seemingly hard question without having to pay for a course or a service to assist you. So rather than be intimidated, you should embrace it early on. Doing so will place you steps ahead of the competition. You can use AI to sell digital creations or artworks. Generators like Dolly 2, Photor, Midjourney, and Night Cafe can help you create stunning works that you never imagined you can do. Whether they be digital paintings or realistically looking photos, these generators can do it all for you. Start looking them up, try them out, and then sell your creations online. Most AI art generators grant commercial rights to their users, so you should have no problem selling them. If you use Midjourney, you can only own the assets you use in creating an artwork if you're a paid member. Still, that's a small investment fee if you're planning to go all out and profiting from AI artworks. You can also use AI to create website content faster and more efficiently. If you have a business, ChatGPT can assist you in writing your web page, sales pages, emails, blog posts, social media captions, and product descriptions. You won't need to hire a writer for your business, which allows you to save money. You can also offer writing services for clients. As ChatGPT becomes more popular, expect more companies to rely on it for their needs. But for now, take advantage of its potential while it's still free of charge. You can also create video content with AI for clients or your business. And since we're already on the topic of using it to serve clients, you can even open an agency that will help solve people's issues through AI. Whether they need someone to do their graphics, write-ups, promotions, coding, or videos, you can be their primary provider by using AI. Now here's the thing. Anyone can use these AI generators to come up with something, but how can you manipulate them into giving you exceptional outputs? This is interesting, so listen closely. There is a technique to optimize your language so that the AI system does precisely what you want it to do. This is called prompt engineering, and it refers to how you construct your prompts or inputs to help the AI system produce more accurate results. Here's how you do it. Whenever you tell ChatGPT to write something for you, include specific details like the topic, how many words you want, the tone of voice or style, the structure of the write-up, and other elements that you want to be there. Telling ChatGPT to write an article about how to exercise won't produce a good result compared to a prompt like, write a 500-word article about how to exercise for building muscle, include a clear introduction, middle, and conclusion, add elements of humor, and have it sound like you're talking to a good buddy. Same goes for AI art generators. A prompt like portrait of a female model may give you a nice result, but portrait of a female model wearing cyberpunk-inspired makeup, short red hair, and set against a futuristic backdrop will provide you with something entirely different and unique. What will put you above the rest is how you tell AI what to do. Many people today only see the negative implications of AI in the future, but as you know, to achieve a different life, you must think differently. So while others avoid or condemn AI, learn to embrace it, harness it, and make money from it. Don't waste time and take this opportunity to invest in the revolutionary power of AI. Remember, change creates millionaires. Those who follow and take advantage of change will be the next success story of the generation. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned a lot from it. If you want more content that can help you develop into a high value person, check out this next video.